Be Zalian. Hey guys, it's Desi here and welcome back to the Crypto. In today's video, I get to talk about the things at my house. That makes sense. And yes, and if you haven't watched the last video, please do so because I talked about a lot of really cool things about my outfits so far this year and the pizza's doing well in that oven. So after I film this video, I cannot wait to get that slice of pizza because I deserve it. If you haven't, haven't been on this channel before, welcome. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel right now because I get to make some more videos about fashion, lifestyle, but mostly fashion because I love it. And don't forget to follow my socials as well and we can gossip, okay? Without further ado, let's get this started. The first thing, I'm gonna do a disclaimer. I am not sponsored, but I'm a stan, okay? I'm a stan, I'm a stan. The first thing is a wax melter. I got this one from the mall. You can put oils in it, you can put wax in it, and once it melts down in it, it's just, it's just good vibes. And what I like about this one is when I plug it up, it lights up, and I love a good nightlight. And this one is pink, so it's kind of reflective of the color of the glass, so it's kind of pinkish, purplish. It's just so majestic, just so beautiful around the rim. And then what I got on right now, the second thing, this one is from the Hummingbird Candle Company and it's in the scent 000 called Cuff. It's in the romantic candle section as well as the signatures. And I love this scent so much and you can check out its notes it's just so good, yummy, but it smells like the ideal perfume. If my ideal perfume is exactly those scents, literally, I will wear it every day. It smells so stinking good. Okay, y'all, the next thing that makes sense is this plant mister. I do not know why it made in my list. I mean, besides giving plants a good mist, you can even put your face mist in there or maybe your scent spray, hairspray, I don't know. You can just mist, mist, mist all over. But me, I'm fancy, got this for three or four bucks at Pop Shelf. And I like to use this as a soap. Yes, I put in my favorite soap right now and I just fill it with a dollar soap or a favorite Bath & Body Works soap. And then once I spray it, it sprays just fine. The thing is with the plant mister, there's this little thing you have to turn in and you have to take out maybe like that little plastic part. And then you can just screw this one back in and that way it can actually function as a soap dispenser because that little white part is kind of like make it the reason why it makes it a mess. So if you were to put in soap in there, it wouldn't work, but take the little plastic thing out and then give this thing a couple pumps or whatever and soap will come out. Thank me later. And you can also check it out on my TikTok video about how this one right here became to be iconic. The next thing is from the dollar section at Target is this cart right here and it's really really cute I like putting this by my bedside table and I usually put medicines or vitamins anything health related well just in case things happen when I'm sleeping in my room whatever during the day during the night when I'm awake I can always put in all my medicines my vitamins even I can just put like a mini jar of whatever I needed by the bedside table. And I think this is really cute just for access, but this is multi-purpose. I think everybody should have one of these. It's so cute and plus it helps you organize your stuff because a lot of y'all need your stuff organized ASAP. Like Rocky. I probably do not want to bring in my plants because it's a little bit too much. 
but I have a couple plants. If you have a Trader Joe's in your city or some grocery stores that offer plants, definitely it's worth purchasing a plant. Even if you're not the most plant savvy, I'm starting to be a plant mom. Well, I am a plant mom and I love plants. Plants, indoor plants help purify the air inside your place, especially when we're in a panoramium. It's really good to have a couple plants just to clear up the air of all the negativity and we're just trying to do plants it all out. I have here is the dwarf palm. So I have this one right here. I believe I got these. All these are under 10 bucks at Trader Joe's. I believe I got this one for like, let's see if you can focus here. I don't think it can focus, but I believe I got four or four or five bucks because it's like the 99 cents and just run it up to one cent. And then I got this one, I know I got this one, the Caladium plant for nine bucks. And it's just thriving as indoor plants. Make sure you guys read the labels because if it requires high maintenance, it's not the best plant to take home. And also do your research as well. So that way, if you're not high maintenance, it can also help you to better choose plants that are suitable for your schedule. For these, I have to wear them once a week or whenever the soil is dry, so that way the plants can continue to thrive at my place. I know this is a debatable topic during a rental, but these run for $1.25 at Dollar Tree or even a dollar at the Family Dollar. Or Dollar General but I like this so far I actually have it across my sink for those who do not have the best of wall space best of aesthetics this right here will change your life I love these I live for these now I just installed them the night before I filmed this video and y'all it looks amazing like I actually chew this up I think this one, because of its glossy space, I think that it kind of is giving me very much whiteboard. And what I think I want to do with this, probably put some markers. I know the little magnets may not stick to it, but oh well. I wanted to make the most out of it, so why not? It's definitely a good self-adhesive, especially if you're living in a space where you can't do too much. But at the same time, wherever you live in is just not the best. This is really good. And also, if you're afraid of bugs, this will also hide any holes in the walls and prevents bugs from getting into your place. Thank you, Lita. For just this video, I will continue on to this list. A cute little bouquet of flowers. And y'all, Dollar Tree, and I'm not sponsored for Dollar Tree, by any means has the best flowers if you cannot afford $200. For those who probably are not good with plants, this is your best bet if you want your place to be beautiful. I mean, they probably won't purify your place, but you can also add them to make it look nice and decorated. What I like to add these, and I've seen it when I was at the mall, when I was working at the mall, there's this there's this kiosk, there's always kiosk everywhere at the mall that scents the flowers and they put the scents on the flowers, like spray a little perfume or put a little oil to it, like a little scented, and it helps, helps it, smells really good. So if you like smells, highly recommend spraying your perfume on the flowers. Maybe a long lasting smell will work and then voila. The place will smell really good and a really good vase this one's from dollar tree as well but any vase will definitely do you can go fancy smashy and spend a little bit more or you can just keep it plain giant and do it i mean there's always tutorials on how to make it fancy with dollar tree items and that's what i'm really interested in so that way i can just improve my place but this will do for now yo the next thing that makes sense yo oh yeah i don't think i can roll it but if you can see my cart, which was featured on my last video, this cart right here, I got this one from Target. And it was on sale for 10 bucks. I believe, it's not Bright Room, but I believe it's Room Essentials, Room Essentials brand. And it was on sale for $10. Target 
Target these days now, it's popping. They give you coupons, coupons, coupons. They put in everything on sale. Make sure you take advantage of these views, especially if you're renting and especially if you have your own place because taking advantage of these deals will help you greatly with that budget. And why not decorate it? I have a couple canvases here. And then I also have this letter box, which I will show you. Let me grab it real quick. Right here. This one's from Fabolo. Love this one. I mean, it's really inexpensive and I don't know. They say not the best quality, but hey, it adds a little bit of decoration and adds a little bit of uh, spunk. Cute. You can just customize your saying. I think you can also customize little letters there as well. I don't even know if they do have like letter replacements or the little marquee light up boards, but potty sauce. That's all I got to say. And lastly, a bonus one is this disco ball that I also got at Five Below. This makes sense, <laughs> okay? I'm sorry, this makes sense. Like, y'all, the girls stay paying 15, 20 plus dollars for a disco ball. Well, you can get this size, the size bigger than my hand for literally like five bucks at Five Below. Five Below, keep selling these. I am begging you. You can also do it in various sizes so the girls can decorate wherever. But I like putting this on my bar cart because it looks good. And yes, I say bar cart. I don't drink alcohol anymore but I just like it for hashtag aesthetics. And that is everything for this video. Thank you guys for watching this video. I have so much fun. Please, please comment below if you want a part two. Maybe I will do it in the future. And I mean, this is not everything in a house that makes sense. There are plenty more things in a house that actually make sense. I can go on and on. But for now, this is what it is. It is what it is. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and see you guys later. Bye.